Hey, kia ora, Helen Burns here coming to you live from Mesa in Arizona. To everybody out there, all my U.S. friends, happy Thanksgiving. It is, um, it's thankful Thursday as well. So, oh, amazing how that all works together. <laughs> but I just wanted to pop on real quick. Um, I am about to have breakfast, then I'm going to go take my final exam for my, um, um, genealogist cert certificate and then we're going to get to enjoying the day so we got the foods all prepped I just go pick out whatever I want to eat when I want to eat it and just basically going to be grazing throughout the day I have another zoom I uh, just got off a of zoom which was really really cool because normally it's our training morning zoom but we just sat there and just went around around the, around everybody just saying what we were grateful for and it was such a blessing to be able to start the day off that way um, so I'm so thankful that I was able to get there. But I have so much to be thankful for. Um, and I was telling them all that um, this year, despite all the craziness and everything else going out there with the global pause, um, this has been my best year ever since Brad passed. Um, I feel really good within myself. Yes, I still have my down days. That is going to happen no matter what. Um, those people that tell you that, you know, oh, you know, you'll get over this in time. Yeah, that's bullshit. I'm sorry. Just going there. But um, I'm grateful for all the adventures we've had to have. I'm grateful I've got Zephy with me. I'm grateful for all the people we've met this year, the travels we've been able to do despite the global pause going on, the opportunities that have become available for us. Um, it has been a very, very blessed year, and I am extremely grateful for it. I am also hugely grateful to everybody that um, tunes in and watches these videos every day. You know, we're on day 483. Who would have thunk? Back in July last year when I got issued the challenge to do a Facebook Live a day that 483 days later we would be here um, still going strong. So um, thank you all for tuning in. You guys um, may not realize this but um, seeing your comments, seeing that people have been watching the videos just makes me um, grateful um, for those of you out there who care enough to watch. So thank you for that. I appreciate it. But I um, just wanted to say just wanted to, um, I'm gonna, like I said, I'm going to make this really quick. It's going to be a very short video today. Um, just look back at this year, and some people are going to be going, no, 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 no. look back at this year and go through and count your blessings and be grateful for every moment that you have had. You know, what things can you be grateful for? Um, maybe it's that you've got a new opportunity that's been presented to you because, um, because of the global pause. You no longer have a job, but over here, you've got an opportunity that's become available to you and you actually find you're actually enjoying that more than you, maybe you did your job. Who knows? Maybe it's the fact that you've got to spend more time with family and friends and um, maybe you've got to finally pick up, dust off that guitar and pick it up and do some YouTube videos. Whatever it is, there is always, always something to be grateful for. Um, like my saying says, no matter what happens today is always super fantastic and sparkling. And I have been through some trials and tribulations and I can attest to that, that um, that, you know, no matter what the day brought, there was always something to be grateful for in the day, whether it was starting the day with a grateful, being able to start the day with a grateful heart was something that I was always grateful for, that I'm always, every day, grateful for. Um, I'm grateful for my dog. Oh my gosh, my dog. She is currently curled up on the bed and she's got her back to the door, which is really unusual. And she's got her nose tucked in underneath the pillows. <laughs> really cute. So I went in there and just threw a blanket over her. I thought maybe she was a little cold. Um, it's a little chilly this morning. We've been out for a great brisk walk this morning. I think it was still in the low 50s when we went out for a walk this morning, which for those of you in the Celsius thing is somewhere in the single digits. Um, so yeah, it was a little brisk out there this morning. So we might have to put the heat on a little bit because it's still a little cool inside the RV, here, even though I'm sitting here in a t-shirt. <laughs> Go figure. Zephyr's curled up on the bed with her nose buried and underneath the underneath the pillows and I'm sort of like and she's tucked in between the blankets so I'm sort of like thinking okay maybe she's a little cold we'll put the heat on for a little bit and um but it's only meant to get to like 71 today so um and for my Celsius people I think that is like high teen I think 71's like high teens I think I can't remember where the 20 degree comes in I know it's somewhere in the 70s so um yeah so it's going to be a little on the cool side today which is fine I like the cooler temperatures. Yay! Um, so whatever you are doing today, have a super fantastic sparkling day. For those of you who are celebrating Thanksgiving, I wish you a super fantastic sparkling Thanksgiving full of love and laughter. Whatever you are doing, stay safe. Um, 
and just have a blast today. Go out there, find find things to be grateful for. Are you able to sit down and have a virtual, you know, if you're not able to be together with family physically, are you able to sit down and have a virtual dinner together? Um, are you able to um, have a um, socially distanced picnic if you wanted to? You know, some people could go have a socially distanced Thanksgiving picnic. There's always something you can be grateful for. Um, so what are some of the things that you're grateful for this year so far? Please let us know in the comments below. Um, and have a super fantastic sparkling day. And we will catch you guys later. Heck on era.